Guys, we swear it's not shade. <laughs> I didn't even we think. We swear that Matt Palmer's outfit is not shade. It really isn't. We I... weren't planning on doing this video today. We weren't. And, and he just showed up wearing this. <laughs> I am obviously a Mariah stan, but I, like everyone else, have heard the clips of this song in recent, and I think it's gonna be her biggest hit since so, Anaconda. Guys, we had to do what we had to do, okay? We had to do what we had to do. We love Mariah, and I'm excited for this new Nicki, and both things can be true. We hold many truths within us. That's true. Yes, 2022. Sure, <laughs> what? Because right. you know, that's when we hold the truths. We've evolved, have you not evolved? You I'm evolved. still young. You, you can evolve and become a better person. And you're not young. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Two Gay Mats. It's Matt Steele. It's Matt Palmer. And we have an impromptu video that we are doing last minute because we just found out that Nicki Minaj has released a new song called Super Freaky Girl. And I mean like, that's appropriate. And it's she's... a song that samples Rick James as Super Freak. Oh. A classic. Okay. This is why. This is going to be a hit. Let's That's go. What I'm let's saying. go. All and right. It's like I, I stand by, I believe this is even just hearing a clip of the song. I feel like it's going to be her biggest hit since Anaconda because the sample in the clip I've heard is so smartly used and so well used. I would say better than the Baby Got Back sample was used in Anaconda. So maybe I'm wrong and the full song will be bad. Like that time that, um, Jack Harlow put out First Class. I heard the clip, thought it was amazing with that Fergie sample, heard the song was garbage. But that was a big hit anyway, so okay. maybe it'll be that, but I hope not. Nicki's very talented rapper, lyricist, artist. I, I have not listened to a new Nicki in quite a while. I believe I listened through Queen once or twice. And, and this is our first Nicki video. Wow. Yeah. First time for everything, you We've know? We've been doing videos for almost nine years, or over nine years, That's... and we still have yet to do a Nicki video. I think now's the time. Now's the time. Now's the time. As you said, 2022, Evolved, yes, yes, remember it? You didn't even say anything because you were trying to be young. <laughs> All right, <laughs> super freaky girl, let's There's go. The cover. How, how long is it? Is it like a minute and a half? Two minutes, 50 seconds. That's not as short as some songs they're releasing nowadays. Hello. It's still short. <laughs> it is. You know, hopefully with the Virgo's groove of it all with Beyonce, hopefully the songs get a little longer. Okay. That's my hope. All right. All right, here we go. Super freaky girl. Let the girls ride with me. Oh, are we going to get a gospel choir? <laughs> I don't believe so. Oh, I love that. <laughs> this is the thing. This sample's so good. It's so good! Mm. It just... <laughs> AK! I told you. What a great song, Super Freakish. A bikini at my ass. Oh. Maybe Mariah can feature. First lot of in this. No, that, I'm, that's a number one. I'm kidding. That was not happening. Oh, yes. Yes, the piano. I guess it's also Can't Touch This. I'm trying to think of like what other song. Sure. But. It is a great hook. <laughs> it is. It is great. Great sample. And just like. Classic, <laughs> gonna go number one. I 
think it's better than Anaconda. Absolutely. Yeah. It is. I feel like there are certain songs that need to be sampled every like 20 years. Mm -hmm. And first it's Tom Tom Club, <laughs> you know, needs to have the 90s version, needs to have 2022. And I think, you know, Super Freak is right there with that. Cause yeah. like what a timeless piece of music. Like, of course it screams like 80s, but it still sounds fresh today. Yeah. Like, and what I love about it is we didn't go like super minor with it. Like no. how in so many songs and like from 2016 onward have sounded like very like minor and we're gonna make this song darker. It's like, no, music is fun now. Hey, Renaissance, it's a post Renaissance world. It's a post Renaissance world, Renaissance world guys. World. And music is now bright and happy and fun and freaky. Yes. And she said something about apple pie, which I wonder, sweetest pie, apple pie, is there an issue? <laughs> What? Remember Sweetest Pie, Megan the Stallion single yeah, that we reacted that. She mentioned apple pie in this, I'm just saying. Okay, I don't think you can like copyright apple pie. It feels like I it's pretty close, all listen, I'm saying. Listen, I'm sure Megan the Stallion has her lawyers on call right now. <laughs> I'm sure those lawyers are like, girl, go to bed. <laughs> I'm just wondering, I very much like this song. It is one of the better like pop mainstream Nicki songs I've heard in such a long time. What do you think the visuals are going to be like for it? Because the video by Anaconda was, was like very, Aggressive. I feel like a this, lot of visuals. I think there will be a lot of visuals. I also think it's an interesting time that we are separating the visuals from the music, you know? Right? Like, it's for so long, it was just like, oh, you have to release the music video with the song. Okay. And now, in the post Renaissance world, <laughs> we are just like releasing the song and the, making people wait in anticipation. Exactly. Do you, I don't remember waiting for anything. We're too used to the instant gratification to deal with waiting. So. I know, we're like, you know, the Gen Zs who've like never known life without an iPhone. <laughs> yeah. We we'll want go, instant gratification. We will go with that. Um, but I very much like the song. Yeah. I'm excited to see what it does. When Nikki first came out, I was a very huge fan of her. I think you recall how many times I played Stupid Ho in that apartment. Oh, <laughs> Stupid Ho is just Stupid a classic, is a classic piece of music. And people talk shit about Stupid Ho. It's excellent. It's like the rap song, I still know all the words, so. <laughs> it's excellent. <laughs> I'm just excited that Nikki has put out something that's going to be so, such a hit worldwide, and it's so clear to see. Um, so, tell us below what you think of Nicki Minaj's new single, Super Freaky Girl. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Matt Power Music. And at It's Matt Steele. And at Two Game Maps for both of us. Uh, let's do our podcast. It comes out every Monday. It's called Two Game Maps on your favorite podcatcher. Become a patron. Go to patreon.com slash Two Game Maps. And for a certain tier, you can request uh, that we review or react to a video of your own. Who should we need to give shout outs to? To Jeff, yes. Adam Parnell, yes. and our newest legendary patron, Fernando. Hi, Fernando. Welcome to the Legendary's Ball. And thank you so much for watching and listening. We'll be back soon with more 2D Maps. Bye. Bye.